That's the truth of this case, of the killing game itself. Well, Tsumugi? Well, what? Yes! What a scorching hot twist! My hand holding the detonator is tensing up! D don't get tense! C -c Calm down! Daddy! Please stop this! Go back to how you used to be! When you loved us so, so much! How I used to be was more suited to a different story than this one. Huh? Basically, your story doesn't matter. I can watch this exciting development! I'm pretty much the same way right now, Monokuma. I gotta see what happens next. If only I knew. Well, Tsumugi, are there any flaws in Shuichi's logic? If so, then please tell us. F flaws? There's a bunch of flaws all over it. Then explain. Y you can do it! You can do it, Samugi! Go, Samugi! Prove Shuichi wrong! You're not the mastermind! Hopefully. E even if you cheer me on... It's not like that! I didn't do it! It's plain to see! Oh, we got another one. Glad we could have one right before your punishment. Please, just say something. If you don't defend yourself... It's Junko and Oshima! <laughs> what? What? You are not going to pull that now! Cause it's always been her! Yeah, sure. Except she's kind of like double dead, triple dead? How dead is this bitch? In the Hope's Peak killing game, and in the Jabberwock Island killing game, uh-huh. Junko and Oshima didn't participate. She controlled the game from outside. She was a fucking AI for one of them. Even if it's boring or repetitive, she's always the mastermind, isn't she? Wait a minute. What did you just say? Then it's like that this time, too. It's gotta be Junko again. Did you br fucking break the fourth wall on me? Junko and Oshima is dead. She's not part of this killing game. Maki? You're wrong. She hasn't been eliminated. She's... She's here! With us! It's all Junko's doing! This killing game is her doing too! Look, I know there was a CG with her talking to Mama Kuma, but there's no fucking way! Not again! Yeah! That's gotta be it! Cause Junko and Oshima is... Junko and Oshima is... The ultimate despair, the mastermind of Danganronpa 1, the computer virus in Danganronpa 2, apparently a MacGuffin in Danganronpa V3. Did I miss anything? Cause Junko and Oshima is... Is actually me! Junko and Oshima is... <laughs> the tensing of my detonator button! What?! Daddy, please don't get so excited! You pressed the button by Look at our cute faces! Can you really bear to be without us? Oh, that was a pun. Press the detonator button. Junko and Oshima is... Me! Junko and Oshima is what?! Get on with it! Okay, time for a commercial break. Don't give me that! No, it isn't! <laughs> I don't want to die! See? We're a good comedy group, too! So please, don't... No! Cause Junko and Oshima is Junko and Oshima is right the fuck here. <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. You've got to be effing with me. Even if nobody was waiting. Even if it makes you go what? Again? Stop calling me out! 
the diva of despair takes the stage once more. Junko Enoshima, the 53rd. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Wait, where's the box? You're really doing this. But you know you're doing this. And you're making me laugh. <laughs> Junko and Hashima, the 53rd? The 53rd? Sumugi, what's the matter? Aren't you Sumugi Shirogane? Our friend who survived with us? What? <laughs> Sorry about that. You can go ahead and forget about Simugi Shirogane. By the way, Junko looking hot in those new sprites, baby. Damn! Because I'm just a character. You know, a lie. Oh, what? Sorry to all her fans out there. If any of you even exist, that is. I'm a fan. Who the fuck are you? A, a lie? Yeah, truth and lies is kind of a big plot point. Okay, now excuse me. Sumuki Shirogane was nothing more than a cover for me, the mastermind. Huh? <laughs> Calling her your friend? Ugh, it's laughable, really. Really? I'm gonna laugh. <laughs> I suppose if you want to get your voice actors back for Danganronpa, might as well start with Junko and her two personalities. Sorry, two voice actresses. Are you serious? You're the mastermind behind this? And I bet you anything, everybody who played Danganronpa V3 for the very first time back in 2017 said the exact same fucking thing. I sense meta. But why? That face and that voice. It's just like... Junko and Oshima. Jesus. I know, right? Oh, does it make you fall into despair? No, it makes me in confused. What is that in your eyes? <laughs> well, does it? I think the best part about this entire thing is when I finally do thumbnails for this recording session, as soon as people see Junko, they're gonna flip their shit. No, that's not possible. Junko Inoshima is dead. She must be a comic book character at this point because she keeps coming back no matter how many times she dies. But why did you call yourself the 53rd? Answer that, please! Don't make me hate you! As history repeats itself, so does Junko Enoshima. How much history is repeated? Yeah. yeah, yeah, I agree. As you can see, I am a perfect reproduction of Junko Enoshima. Perfect. So, you're just a freak pretending to be Junko and Ashima, huh? No, a perfect reproduction. Perfect reproductions are exactly the same as the original. Wait, do that again. Her logic is impossible to follow, much like the real Junko and Ashima's. Whatever it is, you're the actual mastermind of this killing game, right? So if we kill you, then that'll be the end, correct? <laughs> yes! Yes! Kill the ultimate despair, Maki! <laughs> Say mean things like that. Besides, killing me never ends the game. Actually, that's a pretty good point. It never ends the game? What do you mean? According to her, this is the 53rd time she's done this. Oh my fucking god. She's bluffing. Let's just kill her and get it over with. Me and my big fucking mouth. Hold up! Wait, if force is necessary, it should wait until after we see what she... No need, Kibo, because this class trial is over. What? It's already over? Oh, but I just showed up! You killed Kaede, and Monokuma covered it up with a false narrative. The class trials are rigged, and this whole game is illegitimate. Oh, that. Right. Yeah, I definitely messed that up. Sorry about that. 
So. 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 Is that all you have to say? It's about what I expected, honestly. The viewers won't accept that kind of apology. You gotta stop the killing game! Yeah, you hear that, audience? We need to stop the killing game. Oh, hi, Kaede. I'm gonna make a save and we're gonna quit this game. What do you think? Yeah, okay, that was a bad joke. Anyway, back to the game. Huh? The viewers? Yes. The viewers. Um, it seems like you're on the wrong track, so let me explain. Okay. Okay, so first, I'll start with the event that inspired me to plan this killing game. Okay. That was about the time the meteorite impact started intensifying. Did she just start some big story on her own? Might as well let her ramble on. Let me go get some more water. I knew of Hope's Peak Academy's gopher project, and my inner Junko told me... Crushing the Gopher Project, Humanity's Last Hope, would be the perfect despair. That's when I took over the killing game I devised. I forced those selected as Humanity's Last Hope to play my killing game. And then I took the name Tsumugi Shirogane and sneaked in among them. Did Kokichi know about this? Wasn't he a remnant of despair? He was your comrade, right? <laughs> comrade? Junko Enoshima doesn't have comrades. It's like, you don't need a remote after you've thrown out the TV, right? The remnants of despair are just a bunch of despair fanboys and fangirls. But I am despair itself. I am a god of despair. Kokichi was just one of my believers. A god wouldn't be comrades with one of their believers, right? Then Kokichi didn't know your true identity either. <laughs> what a hopeless existence he led. Hey, fuck you, he was fun. To the end, he had no idea the object of his worship was right under his nose. I worship you, Lady Junko. I love you. Give me your right hand, please. I, I don't care about your story. Tell us about the people watching! Okay, audience, this is all about you. Pay attention. Who's this killing game being shown to? Where are the survivors of humanity? God, I remember 2017 Let's Plays. They were... awful. There's nobody watching. What? Huh? What? We were the last 16 people alive, you know. Who could be watching? Humanity is gone. But you're not alive. No, you're lying. If this isn't being shown to anyone, why care so much about rules? You're the one who keeps talking about making the game interesting. For whom? That was just a part of my perfect reproduction. I'm not buying it. You're what? I just perfectly reproduced my own killing game is all. Just like the old Junko. The original was meant to be shown, so that's how I made mine. What? I mean, it matches your personality, but... You just wanted to recreate the past killing game. That's it? Seems a little milk toast. Yep, that's it. There are no survivors of humanity. Things are just as you recall. That is the truth of the Ultimate Academy Killing Game! No, that's wrong! Oh dear! I am so surprised! <laughs> <laughs> not, not the best delivery, but I love that sprite. Maybe we all remember that there's no one left out there. But how do we know our memories are real? Thank you! All right, now we're getting somewhere. What do you mean by that? You think your memories are wrong? She's like radiating light. What is going on? There's something that's been bothering me about our memories. Here, look at this book. 
complete history of Hope's Peak Academy? This book contains years of research about Hope's Peak Academy. Nothing would indicate this book is a prop. I believe the information here is accurate. But there's a lot written in here that differs from our memories. What is different? To know that for certain, I'll need everyone's help. I want you all to tell me everything that you remember about Hope's Peak Academy. We just need to talk about what we remember from Hope's Peak? Okay. Um... So it started with the biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. That event originated at Hope's Peak Academy, inspiring wars and terrorism around the world. It would not be hyperbole to say that event brought despair to all mankind. And it was all caused by a single high school girl. It was me! Junko Enoshima enrolled in Hope Speak Academy as the ultimate fashionista. But my real identity was the ultimate despair. In order to cover the world in despair, I put my plans... Wait a minute. Something doesn't add up here. Huh? I detect no discrepancy in my memory banks. Yes, everything we just said is just like we remember it. But it doesn't match what's written in the history of Hope's Peak Academy. Oh, okay. So you gotta play Spot the Difference! I love this game. Point out what everyone is mistaken about in their memories of Hope's Peak Academy. Time to play some Dongon Rumpa Trivia! You just called out the name of your game. If you're gonna go this meta, I might as well too. Let's go! The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. That event originated at Hope's Peak Academy. Inspiring war and terrorism around the world. The cause of all that despair was just a single high school girl. A student of Hope's Peak Academy? The ultimate despair! Junko Enoshima! I did everything in my power to spread despair over the entire world! Hmm. Hold on a second. Found in the ultimate ultimate supreme leaders. Oops. Uh, let's see. That work claims is compiled by several esteemed researchers. It is the most thorough and accurate book written. However, it contradicts the flashback like he was in documents. He was in his spark and referred to both of you. Much about the darkness. Uh, so to protect themselves. Uh, God, there's a lot. Did not admit students by application. The only way to admit is by scouted. Uh, punch one of the uh, the bloody killing your host okay okay I think I know what they need to do was the ultimate despair really just one person no the ultimate despair turned into multiple people it was actually her and her sister if I remember correctly they were both ultimate despairs so the statement I believe is the next one no it is not the single high school girl it was a group what? Hope's Peak Academy. The ultimate despair. Did I just shoot it wrong? Junko Oops. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and speed this up. Wow, Junko, I didn't expect you to show up like this. I'll be honest. I mean, you're, you're looking good, baby. For the 53rd. Whatever the fuck that means. Anyway, let's try this again. Single high school girl. Nope. There we go. That's wrong. One high school girl started the tragedy, the ultimate despair, Junko Enoshima. At least that's what I remember, but that's not what this book says. Ultimate despair doesn't just refer to Junko Enoshima. 
It refers to a group and the movement that came after. To put it simply, there's more to ultimate despair than Junko Inoshima. This is the first time I've heard about this. Wasn't Junko the ultimate despair? That's what I recall as well. That label should only apply to her. Coincidences sure are scary. Everyone misremembered the same thing. Hmm, suspicious. Coincidence? Misremembered? And that's not all. There are other discrepancies I'd like to point out. Ugh, does it even matter? I'm bored already. Just shut up. So, let's continue where we left off. Junko resorted to different tactics to cover the world with despair. The killing game between the 78th class of Hope's Peak Academy, for example. They were locked up and forced into the killing game by the ultimate despair. But boo hoo! When I, the one who started it all, died, events were set in motion. And the world began to move towards restoration. Then the fight between the future foundation and the remnants of despair raged on! The worst case scenario was avoided! Yay! A happy ending. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history happened. Because Junko had prepared countless ways of spreading despair. Like the killing game of the 78th class of Hope's Peak Academy. They were held prisoner by the ultimate despair. And forced into the killing game. Oh, I have some bad news about that. The events that my death set in motion... ...are only now reaching their climax. <sighs> So the remnants of despair in the future foundation are still fighting, but for now, we've avoided the worst of it. Sorry, like, right in the middle of that, I got extremely curious as to what the lie bullet says. And, yo figure, it's the Ultimate Academy. Why did I think it would be anything different? Um, I got it. Yeah, I got it. Uh, we're actually going to target Ultimate Despair this time, because it's still technically wrong. There it is. That's wrong! It wasn't the Ultimate Despair that trapped the 78th class in Hope's Peak Academy. It was the class themselves. They shut themselves in. Shut themselves in? Why would they shut themselves in? It has to do with the Hope's Peak Academy shelter project. During the tragedy, the 78th class trapped themselves inside Hope's Peak Academy for protection. So our memory of the 78th class being trapped by the ultimate despair? Are you saying our memories are wrong? God, it looks like I have to replay the first and second game. It has been years since I Let's Played those games, so yeah, and with my memory being the way it is. It just means those documents were written all half-assed. Oh no. Danganronpa has never been half-assed. Even if it's in the history books. There's no need to worry about it. Your memories are all correct. Uh, nope. What you've been saying isn't consistent. First you said it was just coincidence. Huh. Is that so? Let's just move on. I want to talk about one more thing from our memories. It's about the rebuilt Hope's Peak Academy that we were attending. What about Hope's Peak Academy? There's no doubt that the 16 of us were students at Hope's Peak Academy. We heard it had been rebuilt, and was accepting applications for talented students again. 
And so, we gathered at the brand new Hope's Peak Academy. Since Hope's Peak Academy was large, we were all in separate classes. But there's no doubt we were students of the new school. I think there's one more thing that doesn't add up. If only we could see what the rest of the flashbacks were in the flashback light room. Hope's Peak Academy was rebuilt. And with that, recruitment of talented students resumed. When we found out, we came to the new Hope's Peak Academy. The new Hope's Peak Academy was a huge school. Which is why we were all in different classes. But we're all the same! That's right! We were all students of Hope's Peak Academy! Wait a minute. Wait a minute, I actually caught that one. Yeah, what is going on here? It was rebuilt, yes. With Danganronpa trivia. Oh wait, there it is! Recruitment! That's different! That's wrong! 